Hey y'all, it's Kathy Bo. I am here with the um, paper pumpkin for October and about to open it up. Please hold. There we are. I need to tag a friend here. Come on now. I'm sorry, it's going to take me just a second. And let's see. Okay, so do not look if you don't want to see it yet. Okay, that's the main thing. You don't want to see it, don't look. Because here we go. All right. Hi, Mackenzie. Good to see you. Now, if, if y'all don't want to know what's in here, don't look. I won't be sad if you go away. Because it's a spoiler. Where's all... Oh. <laughs> Hi, Karen. Okay, so it's spoiler alert. We're about to see what's in here. Come on now. So, Karen, I was like, where's all my scissors? <laughs> They're out there. Karen was over here this morning for our church ministry card making group. Okay, first of all, look how pretty the box is. Can y'all just see how pretty? I love it. It's just, I love that because Paper Pumpkin, um, they always make it very special. All right, this is part one of two over there. That's right. Um, it is pretty. And this is part one. And this, this one's going to be part two. It's going to coordinate. Now, they said that this one is going to be cards. So, I don't know what number two is going to be, but you don't want to miss it. If you're not subscribed, go to paperpumpkin.com and please name me as your demonstrator. Y'all don't want me to starve now, do you? Okay. <laughs> Wishing you a Merry Christmas and a very Happy New Year. That's one of the sentiments. Um, got little dots, which I guess we can use for snow. Got a snowflake. Got a little red cardinal. Seasons, greetings, and winter wishes. All right, that's our, that's our stamp set. Easy for me to say, right? Okay, okay, okay. Stampin' Spot is Knight of Navy, one of my favorite colors. Yay! Hey, Sue. Um, oh, okay. One of my one of my um viewers said that the number two kit that we're going to get is tags. That is very cool. Oh, y'all look at these. Oh my goodness. Now this kit, if you're just coming on and you've not um you've not seen this before. This kit is $22 a month. It's got every single thing in here that you're going to need to make a project. And, um, I mean, like everything. Like, it's got your, your adhesives. Your first kit will come with a block. It'll have your adhesives. It'll have all the things, even the ink. Yay! Okay, so here we go. We'll see what's in here. All right, first of all, we get our picture of the finished cards. These are beautiful. The envelopes are pretty. And this is the instructions. You can either just kind of go by the pictures or just um, read the instructions if you're a first-time stamper. This little block right here is going to be the first block you get in a kit. And you'll hang on to that block and use it every month. Okay? So we're going to get to stamp. We're going to get to do all kinds of things. These are the little adhesive dots. They are sticky on one side, and you peel this paper off, and they'll be sticky on that side. I'm just going to put the pictures right there so I can see them as we go. Let me flip this over. Oh, we got some pretty snowflakes. Those are very pretty. My dog is in there crying. You'll probably hear that, but he's got his daddy with him. Um, these are pretty, they're little die cuts, and there's two pages of them, and they're, um, little wood, you can see how they're used behind the greeting here, 
we're going to lay that down on the front of the card and then put the greeting over it. Okay, and here's our envelopes. Now, I was very interested in the quality of the envelopes, and they're good quality, and look, they've got that on the inside. I love that. Love it. So, let's see. Um, How many cards is it? Three, four, five, six, seven. That's not right. It's not seven cards. Let's see how many it makes. Hmm. Let's see. We get a stamp set, stamping spot, ten card bases, ten envelopes, three sheets of die cuts, ten of the shimmery white die cuts, two sheets of silver foil label. We'll get to those in a minute. Um, the snowflake sequins, mini dimensionals, and adhesive dots. And you see here's some alternate projects here. That is gorgeous. They all are. Okay. So, we'll put the envelopes over here. Oh, look. Y'all, these are so sweet. I love the colors, don't you? So pretty. These are the, um, the little, not labels, tags, whatever they are. And here are going to be our die cuts and things like that. So let's see what's in here. Hey, Tammy. Um, Mackenzie, it is Knight of Navy. The um, stamping spot is Knight of Navy. Probably my favorite besides Coastal Cabana. Here's all the little um, cardinals that you're going to see on the card where it's... Um, on the trees. These are Stampin' Dimensionals. They're thick, foamy, sticky dots that will pop up our sentiments and other items that we want to do. Okay, these are gorgeous, y'all. I don't know if you can see, but let me undo it. They're die cuts. They're going to go on front of our cards like this. And I don't know if you can see, but they're shimmery. I'm going to try and turn it just a bit. Hopefully you can see that that's shimmery. Isn't that gorgeous? Oh, my goodness. Um, <laughs> yeah, Tammy says, you and your cardinals. There's there's a story there on our crafting retreat. Um, this cardinal was on my car, and he fell in love. No, he didn't either. He fell in hate with, with his reflection that he thought was another cardinal, but indeed it was him. And he kept pecking at himself on my car, um, but I didn't mind. He left me a beautiful feather. Okay, so this is this is where I pulled it out of the die cut and what's left is another, you know, all of this is shimmery is what I'm saying. So you can use any of these as extra uh, little card stock. You can punch it or however you wanna do it. So let's make one, okay? All right, so we're going to, since they're all the same design in in the actual suggested picture, I'm just going to make the one, and we'll do some alternative projects later, maybe, but we'll see. Well, I left my bone folder out there. So, Karen, clearly I have not done anything since we crafted earlier, but take a nap. That's right. I took a nap. And... If you are not yet a customer, um, oh, Mackenzie, I didn't realize that. Uh, cardinals are a visit from a loved one who's passed away. That's very sweet. Um, and very, very, that that's very sweet. I like that. If you are not yet a Paper Pumpkin customer, it's $22 a month. And go to paperpumpkin.com. Don't use this. Um and name me as your demonstrator, Kathy Bohannon. And all you gotta do is just um, just subscribe. You can subscribe for one month or three months or six months or a year. You can give it as a gift, however you wanna do it. Um, people love these uh, little kits and it's always a surprise what we're gonna get. Okay, so first it tells me we are going to stamp. Stamp the sentiment on the die cut label. What do you mean? Oh, the sentiment. Stamp the snowflake texture on the card base. Okay, got it. All right, I'm actually going to follow directions, people. 
Yes, I am. Don't get excited. That does not happen a lot. Let's see. Here we go. Um, these new, when they're first new, I like to just kind of, you know, rub them off a little bit because, they, I don't know, they got some sort of manufacturing stuff on them. Um, and the block I'm using is not the block you get. This is a, a block that you can purchase through Stampin' Up. The block you get is thinner, but it's it's a standard size that's always going to fit fit your paper pumpkin stamps. If for any reason it did not fit, they would um, send you a new block. All right. Um, I'm going to use this simply because it's the same exact color, and I don't really want to open that other one, take the time right now to open it. So just going to ink up my little stamp. And this might get a little messy, you guys. I have no promises. Who knows? So apparently, it's a night snowfall. Look how pretty. Oh, I love that, y'all. Look at that. Who would have thunk? Let's see how much snow they want on there. Um, They want that much. Okay, that's enough snow. Okay, so we'll put that to the side. And I will get a different block. And, of course, you can use the same block all the time. Um, we're going to stamp the sentiment. Let's see what we want. Winter wishes, season's greetings, wishing you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. I've, I don't think that's going to work. Um, I guess winter wishes. No, I, no season's greetings. I, I really prefer a um, faithful type sentiment. Um you know, because I'm a Christian and I prefer that. However, I'll use Season's Greetings because sometimes I just give cards away to total strangers, which really and truly would be better if I had a faith-based greeting. But I can change it later. All right, so I'm going to stamp. Oh, y'all, that is gorgeous. Wow, look how gorgeous. Okay, okay, okay. So I'm actually following directions. Adhere the trees. Adhere the trees. All right, let's see. Um, Where did my tree go, y'all? Here it is. And there's a shiny side and a not a shiny side. So we're going to do that. We are going to adhere our trees. Now, it comes with those little sticky dots. But you can use snail adhesive, which, you know, I'm going to do that just for the sake of time on the bottom. But on the rest of it, I will show you how these little dots work. Because you guys that are not customers just can't wait to be customers, right? And as soon as I'm done with this video, you're going to run over there and sign up. And, hear, and I want you to know what to do with them right and you will get the next month um you won't get this kit that's the way it works when this ships it's over but you would get the next month and this one may be available to buy after everybody has gotten theirs that has been reserved so you see these little these little dots i'm just pulling them off see if i can put it on the red pull them off of here and they're sticky on this side, and I'm just going to put them down, and then I'm going to peel up the little paper. I hope you can see that well. Okay, let's see. Um, put a little one here. Uh-oh, let go, let go. It gets a little crazy, y'all. I mean, you know, we don't need a ton of glue here, but we do want enough to where um, our trees don't go, you know, flipping all around, right? We can't have that. We're not having like a nor'easter. We're just having a little winter scene. And speaking of, there are people up north that need our prayers today because they are indeed having some kind of a, it's in the northeast, it's some kind of a, um, typh 
I don't remember what they called it, typhoon or not typhoon. I don't know what it's called, but it's a it's a terrible storm. Like a nor'easter, I guess, but um they don't get typhoons over there. Um northeast United States. I remember what they called it. But um yeah, so y'all please be in prayer for them as they have no power and a lot of people are in a lot of difficult situations from that. Okay, so I'm just using these little dots to basically pin down these trees here. Please hold. And I know this is tedious here, but you know, we got to pin the trees down, people. We can't have our trees flying all around. I mean, that would not be pleasant. You send a card and they get popped in the head with a tree. Rude. Okay. So here we go. I'm going to put this little guy. I'm looking at the bottom and lining that up first. And then I'm going to go woohoo right there and woohoo right here. Okay. So we got that done. All right, we're gonna flip our directions over. We've done this and we've done that. Now it says, this is like one of the simplest kits I think I've ever seen because it's just easy. All right, we're gonna put this down. And again, we would use um, right here, I mean, it. you might want to use some of the dimensionals, but I'm not gonna use it on this layer. I'm gonna put this here all right, and then I'm going to pop this one up with dimensionals. So, hey, where do these go? Hadn't seen a mask for that yet. All right, hold on. Please hold. Here we go. Okay, these are the little dimensionals, and you see they're kind of spongy things? Well, you may not get to see that, but I'll show you here. They're um, foamy things, okay? And we're just going to put one here, and one here and here's a pro tip <laughs> all of this edging here it's just as good as these here all you gotta do is cut it down and use it too so do not throw that away how do you like that pro tip like i'm home depot how do you like that huh y'all wouldn't believe the nap i had today karen did you take a take a nap uh if there are refills can they buy them yes they can they can buy refills if they um if they get on in time. So if this is something you want and you have subscribed, all you gotta do is go to paperpumpkin.com and get the refills. And if you don't see them there, go to kathybow.stampinup.net and you will um, go to put Paper Pumpkin there and buy them off of my store. Either way, just name me as your demonstrator, please. Okay, and um, Hey, Carol, I'm glad you're here watching Late But Live for a while. Good, good, good. Okay, so there we go. Now, I don't think we're done because we got some more little things to do. Adhere Cardinal die cuts. You get two per card. And the Snowflake Sequins. Okay, that's easy. And it says to use the adhesive dots. So here we go again. Um, here's my little Cardinals. The ones that like to peck at my car. Now you got them facing this way and that way. All right. Oh, these are so sweet. Y'all, this kind of thing for the price is just absolutely such a deal. Not kidding. I would not wolf you on that. Mama, you say, I wouldn't wolf you. Now, I guess she's saying wolf. Like, what's his name in the wolf? I don't know. It's not Peter and the Wolf, is it? That was a play way back when. Hold on. Which way are our birdies going? Okay, they're sitting on a branch. I was just going to float mine on the tree. Did y'all see that? I tell you what. Miss Nature, I am not. Okay, hold on. Here we go. Get us another one and put that on this guy. And if your dot looks a little big, you can roll that, um, that glue a little bit up under him. I hope you can see that. So it's not a big dot. It's just kind of rolled up, okay? And then I'm going to put him on this branch. No. Yeah. I'm going to put him here. Okay. 
So now they want us, they really want us to use these little dots for these. Okay, fine. I will be a team player. But um probably this would not be my go-to way to get these on. But I really don't know how else I would do it. They suggest using five per card, which means they have given you enough for that. So here's the way I'm gonna do those. I'm gonna put the dot down first. Peel off its little paper and then take my little sequin, assuming I can pick it up and put a little glue on it. Come on now. Okay, fine, I'll pick it up with my hand. How about that? Huh, who knew, that worked. Okay, so that, that works. Got a dot and, oh, come on. There we go. And we're gonna put another sequin on that. Let's see. Wolf, you like to pull one over on a person. I'm getting Yeah, that's what it means. Just kind of like teasing somebody. Um catch the rest of the replay. Oh boy, Mackenzie, bless your heart. Enjoy that. Well, I mean you can't, but God bless you. Um Karen, Tammy, <laughs> y'all are funny. Those are really pretty and easy. Yes, they're so easy, and I love the design. It is just gorgeous, y'all. I love it. But, you know, I love Christmas. I really do. I love me some crema. Crema. That's what my daughter used to call it, crema. Okay, so you see my little, my little snowflakes? It's happening. It's happening. Oh, let's see. I think I might put one over here. That'd be good. You don't want to line things up. You know, you want your card to look, to look, I don't know. Just don't line them up. We don't want to line things up. Maybe we need one over here. I think so. But now I want all the snowflakes because they're so pretty. Okay, so here we go. And if y'all didn't want to see the new paper pumpkin, I'm sorry, but I, I had a disclaimer at the very beginning of the video. There we go, y'all. Here's our card. Isn't that gorgeous? I love the font. Yes, Karen, I love the font. It is so pretty. There we go. And I love those little snowflakes. The um, shimmery trees, it just looks cold. And those cardinals, they're just so beautiful. So that is the October Paper Pumpkin. I've been very eager to get this one because it's Christmas and because it's, um, it could just be a winter card. It doesn't have to be Christmas because of the sentiments that come with it. Um, but I have also been very eager to get it because it's part one of two. So go ahead and subscribe to Paper Pumpkin. Get part um, two coming, and hopefully you'll be able to pick up part one as well. But according to um, Mackenzie, um, she said that um, part two is going to be tags. So that's really cool. So you guys, thank you for stopping by, and I'm glad you were here to see Paper Pumpkin. I'm so excited. This kit is beautiful. I wish I'd ordered two. I might have to go back and get a refill kit. So thanks for stopping in. God bless. Toodles.